Good evening, everybody. Good morning, good afternoon, good day. My name is Arni. I am back again for another stream here for you guys in this XTC tournament between Spain and Hungary, guys. Uh, group D match, uh, round six, uh, game seven. It is a simultaneous game as well happening between Hungary and Spain at this point in time while this game is busy. Uh, being streamed by Sydney City Space Lux. So if you guys want to also tune into that one, be my guest, more than welcome to do that. And yeah, so um, we have two interesting lists here. Um, separatists um, for Spain being flown by Ander Lopez. And then for Hungary, we've got the resistance being flown by Janos Rafi. I'm just going to call him Rafi. That's what he <laughs> said will be fine. I'm just going to call him Rafi. And um, yeah, guys, uh, Hungary against Spain tonight. Uh, let's go through the list quickly. Uh, before we do, just uh, esteemed himself, Mr. Pikachu, also joining for this game, sitting in the background, watching, and making sure that I don't mess up the stream. Yeah. Like what he's going to do. Anyway. <laughs> So uh, the guys has already set up their rocks now quickly. Um, Hungary will be on the left hand side of the, the map and Spain will be on the right hand side of the map. And uh, they have... Uh, Hungary has put their ships uh, basically in the middle, runabout and Spain on each side of the map. And it looks like they are ready to go. And once they are ready to go, then... Uh, I will quickly run through the lists. And let's quickly run through the lists here for Rafi. Uh, he's flying four times T70 X Wings, all of them with BB Astromech. BB Astromech, before you execute a blue maneuver, you may spend a charge to perform a barrel action. Uh, also fitted with jamming beams and integrated S-foils as a standard. Integrated S-foils is always on the T-70 X-Wings. If not, then you're flying it wrong. Sorry. Anyway, so uh, jamming beams as well to uh, get rid of that uh, target lock focuses and any other type of square or circle token that you would not want on the ship. And then supporting the in the resistance transport pod is Rose Tico. Flying with C-3PO. So while you coordinate, uh, you can gain a calculate token as well uh, in that specific unit. Yeah, after you perform a calculate or coordinate, you're going to calculate. So either one of the two, you gain two, which is pretty cool. Then on Spain side, we've got under flying the Zam Django, which is on everyone's... Uh, mind these days <laughs> whether it's a, a full exact copy of all the other lists that people are flying i'm not exactly sure but let's just go through that as well we've got Django fit in the fire spray class patrol craft with lone wolf jamming beam chancellor palpatine chancellor palpatine is after you defend if the attacker is in range zero to two you may spend one force if you do, the attack against one stress token. So he basically gives them a stress token. And then I think that's the other side of the card. Yeah, other card is Darth Sidious. You perform a purple coordinate action. The ship you coordinate gains a stress token. And then it gains one focus token and recovers a force. So yeah, let's see that one in action. I actually haven't seen that in action yet. So let's, let's see how that works. Thermal detonators and false transponder codes. Most of all the Zam Django lists has got false transponder codes on as well. So uh, yeah, that is a staple on that ship. Zam Weasel as well in the fire spray class as well. Thermal deaths, jamming beam, Count Dooku. Count Dooku, you obviously roll for defense. Um, you name a result and whatever you don't get, you can change to. So, if you don't get the result, you change it. And then obviously thermal deaths and false transponder codes as well on uh, Zam Wessel. An interesting matchup here that we have. Um, as mentioned, Spain on the right hand side. They set up both one ship on top and on bottom. 
and Hungary right in the middle of the board flying towards the asteroid field and they are they are already one game one round in while I was busy with the lists and um, yeah they are going for it a lot of bumps there from the T7 X-Wings and uh, the one blue squadron just basically making sure those bumps happen because he doesn't want to go too fast with the X-Wings and then Zam and Django moving in I think they both did a hard right uh, one hard right and one hard left uh, where do they do yeah Zam banked in three and Django hard turned left and he boosted right so yeah guys interesting interesting matchup Oh, I see there's a few people that join the stream. Welcome, guys. Thank you for watching. And uh, like I said in all the other streams, hope I can make this stream for you as entertainable as possible. Right, so. Blue Squadron X-Wing Blue. He moved three hard to the right. And boosted in. Yellow moves one bank right, takes a focus. Green moved in one bank right, took a focus. Rose hasn't moved yet. Rose moves one bank right. You're going to stay there or is she going to battle roll? I don't know. I think red also. Yeah, red went one forward and he bumped as well. All right, now Zam, he dialed in a one forward. And I'm sure that. Oh, no, he did the one forward already. I'm like, he didn't move yet. Sorry. <laughs> Late evening, guys. It's 10 o'clock here in South Africa. So, uh, not usually my bedtime, but uh, it is quite late. Latish. But I don't mind bringing you guys some entertainment for tonight. Because that's what I do. What I do. Zam moving. Django moving left. And he is just staying there. You can focus. Yep. And uh, checking for arcs there on blue. He is seeing X Wing. Nothing there. So it's back to dials, guys. Back to dials. All circle tokens to be removed. That's how it goes. I love coming in here for Pikachu. <laughs> you guy, he like they like you. <laughs> I 
All right, so planning still going in here from uh, from Hungary's side, but obviously more ships to think about than uh, Spain at the moment. So we almost ten minutes into this game. No points yet, obviously, because there was no range from nobody, and a lot can still happen here. Right, so Rafi says he's ready. Zam, oh, Zam, <laughs> Under is also ready almost. I think there's nothing in system phase at the moment. I think they're still too far away to drop some bombs. The real need to drop bombs. <laughs> These guys are making sure that the the maneuvers they're doing is 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 working for them. Right, it's under is also ready to go. Right, so look, there is a BB. A charge spent by Blue X-Wing. He barrel rolls. Fans and no, that BBA charge is... Before you execute the Blue Maneuver, you may spend... Okay, so... Before you execute the Blue Maneuver. So it is a reveal, and then before you execute, you can do the barrel roll. Okay. Three straight from yellow. Oops. Keeping his, his falls open. Not like he can actually change it right now. <laughs> Welcome everybody for this game between Spain and Hungary. Welcome to everyone who joined the stream. Thank you for the support. And uh, I'll bring as much more possible in the next rounds coming. See if I can pick up some more games and stream them for you guys to watch. Right, so that was a three bank and a boost from red. Rose doing a one bank to the left. There's a quite a, a widish arc net that has been dropped or spun. Or thrown or tossed out or I don't know either one of the three you guys can choose by um, Rafi because he definitely wants to get either Django or Zam but it looks like Zang Django is the obvious choice so uh, now we just need to see what under decided to do looks like there was a target lock put on Django, but Django decided to spin uh, these, not decided, it procs automatically. So the false transponder codes on uh, Django was procced. So that's off, so no more target lock there. And Zam comes in with a one bank to the right. Having a few of those X-Wings in arc. He's focusing up. And then a one hard here from Django. Django is choosing violence. That's a lot of guns on on Django. Do this X Wing sitting behind the rock as well as Django behind the rock. So it all depends what is the result of the arcs gonna be. Django taking a focus.
center myself. Right, guys, there is shots being fired in this activate in this engagement round. So Django is firing. What is that? That is a blank. Yeah. So it's two blanks in hit. And evaded. I didn't exactly show you who he shot at. I think it might have been blue. Because blue don't have any di uh, modifications. And Zam is also shooting at blue. Right, dice is on. Got another hit and two blanks. And we've got two blanks from blue. Nothing I can do about that. So blue takes one shield. Now it's the X-Wing's turn. So Rose in the shuttle wants to go first. He wants to shoot somebody. Or the transport pod. I do apologize. Rose taking a focus in a, in a hit. Using that calculate token to change it to a hit as well. So two hits. Into Django. It connects. Django takes two shields. Because Django rolled two blanks. Oh, that is what happened there, guys. Range three obstructed. Oh, it's not obstructed. No, it's not obstructed. Oh, wow. Green rolls natties. Crit hit hit. And Django flips that force, I think. Yeah. And he rolled it into after modifications three evades, so there's no damage on Yeah, he spent the force. He didn't put the force next to his ship, so I wasn't sure what's happening there. But it's definitely three evades there. Okay, yellow shooting at Zam. Does he have an arc? Why is it four dice? It's supposed to be three dice, isn't it? It focused on the crit. On yellow. Looks like Zam took, didn't take any damage there. Why is he running three with four with Zam? Okay, that's a sorry, that's a two crits and a blank. Okay, so looks like there is no. Dice stats on Okay, so blue's only doing two dice. And it blanked out. Yeah, you use the force in the previous engagement, Zem. Uh, uh, previous defense. Zach's next round. Welcome everybody to the stream. It's XTC game between Spain and Hungary.
just shields lost on Django and blue 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 squadron I'm just gonna say blue x-wing easier blue x-wing lost a shield and Django lost two shields next round both of the forces were spent let's just put it back there we go Interesting to see now what Zam and Django is going to do. All these X-Wings coming in. That's still a very wide net cast there. But at least one of the X-Wings are... No, maybe not even one of them. Um, all of them should clear that debris. Debris. Hey, late for me. Gas cloud. Should clear the glass cloud. And with that being able to move in either into Zam or Django, depending. But um really don't think that there is going to be any how can I say any need for 4Ks from the X-Wings? No, no need for 4Ks. Cable is stuck. Cable is loose. Cable is ready to go. Okay, dials are surely but slowly getting set. X wings are still tightly in formation. I see this was uh, Type Punishers with uh, a, um, what's his name, as a trajectory simulator. You could have launched the bombs at range, range 5. Pretty cool. Don't know if you can get a trajectory simulator here. I don't think so. Nope. Battle upgrade will only give you a... Actually, you can. No, you can't. You can't. Skill Bombardier. Project Simulator is a... Another mod. Hmm. Interesting. So, Zam obviously doesn't want to get in the thick of things there. question is, where is he going to go, though? This is interesting. Let's look at the dials for the the slave. Not hard ones, hard twos. Bank ones, bank twos, obviously. No hard threes though, but they do have talent rolls. And four straight and four K. Okay. Right. Uh, Rafi signals he is ready.
Stuff is gonna happen soon, guys. Stuff is gonna happen soon. They are getting ready. And uh, Andor says he is ready. Right, so the first dial this round is going to be flipped soon. And Blue moves a one bank to the right. He is... Oh, wow, he is barrel rolling? So he obviously wants to get that block onto Zam. Um... So he with his integrated S falls closed, we'll do a focus and barrel roll, which is linked action, therefore the stress. Yellow coming in one bank to the left, missing that rock, taking a target lock. And then triggering the false transponder codes. No, but it, has, it hasn't been triggered already. It's been triggered now. That is false transponder codes of Zam. Red goes one straight forward. Oops. Green reveals the green. Ah, reveals the blue. Allows him to do a BB-8 roll. With that BB roll, he does a one bank fast rose. Well flown here, Mr. Ruffy. Well played. Green loses a, a BB-8 extreme charge. And everyone else is still good. Rose moving quite fast. No, she's not that fast. Too straight. Then she is going to, I think, coordinate. Focus on to yellow. Ooh, and there's a the turn away. There's a the turn away. I think that is, at the moment, the best maneuver that, that Zam can do to assist Django and Django decides to go fast. Although he hits the rock, though, I don't think he's going to have any one more than one shot going at him. Rolls for the gas cloud, gets no strain. So he's still good. He's got nothing to worry about. He's got shots on. Front and back arc. Got one on Rose and he's got one on a red X-Wing. What would Django do? Rose, yes. The coordinates, obvious uh, choice. So Django onto Rose, range one. Firing. Three hits and a focus. Is he spending anything? No, he can't. He doesn't have a... Django range two. What can Django do? Off you defend primary difficult maneuver. Okay. So Rolls rolls a... <laughs> rolls Royce. It almost sounds like Rolls Royce. A focus and a blank using the calculate, I think. Oh, the Django used the force there. Uh, yes, Django used the force. Django used the force to change that to a hit. And I think uh, Rose used the one, cal uh, one calculate. There's a shield and. Oops, sorry, guys. Killed and two hits on Rose. Right, so that is from Zam. Three dice into blue, I think. That's a hit crit focus in the blank. And then blue spins. 
right blue spins is focus to change that hit into a uh, if focus into an evade taking only one shield more on blue so now it is time for x-wings to fire x-wing green range three onto zam pew pew it is a hit crit and a blank zam rolls evade two blanks oops right he flips his flips his card it is you bit the mean business They can't attack back, so that is another shield on Zam, if I'm mistaken. No, one shield on Zam, sorry. One shield on Zam. Okay. Come in. Flip it back again. That was a hit blank and two focuses. Hit blank into focuses. I hit two focuses a blank. He changed. He used the focus to change. And so one more shield on Zam, I think. Guys, not updating the board. Unless I'm missing something here. I think there's another hit that came through on Zam. They might they might have missed it. Oh, unless he dookoed into an evade. Never mind, he dookoed into evade then. Okay, so from yellow into Zam, three dice. Hit it blank. Zam rolling. And them not takes another hit. Right, and a blank. Sorry, guys, it's a bit uh, difficult to keep track of these dice. For some reason, the the game chat doesn't show the dice results. Okay, so bonus attack back from Zam. Hit and two blanks into yellow. And yellow says no, not today. With the evade and a blank. So that was the bonus attack back again. Okay, so now there's opportunity for both Django and Zam to drop some thermal deaths here. Because they're in the better spot now to be able to do that, that thermal deaths. And that is what they are for there. There hasn't been a lone wolf use yet because these two guys are flying within range two, I think. A lone wolf did not proc yet.
Like I need to be more attentive on this game now. Because there's a few trigger misses. Or item changes that needs to be done once something happens. I think blue, blue, X-Wing, I think you might just go right. He's got a stress, so he has to get rid of that stress with the blue. So he might just do a bank blue. Green, I think, is going to have to anticipate that bombs coming back out of... Django's ship. <laughs> well, Azam also needs to potentially drop a bomb. If he drops a bomb, then we're going to have to wait and see what happens in that next round or in the round after the bombs are dropped in the phase after the bombs are dropped. Yo! Sorry for talking nonsense, Pikachu. Oh, so it seems like both of them are ready. There's definitely a system phase coming up. I can feel it. Like a uh, famous song. Feel it in my fingers. And there is the charges being spent. I saw it coming. Zam is going to drop a thermal detonator. Range 2 and range 1. Let's just change that omelette. Two thermal dates from Zam and two thermal dates from Zango. Django, sorry. Here we go, guys. That is system phase. So. That is a two Right. Yeah, no, it's two left. Yeah, two left. Overlapped and getting a strain. Medicine is making me sleepy. So we've got 37 minutes left in this game, guys. 37 minutes left. We've got a little bit of blood drawn. Where is that little bit of blood drawn? Oh, Rose. Sorry. Rose is half points. So that is 15 points towards Spain and 0 points still for Hungary. Oh. Oh. Three hard bumped into yellow. Both those ships are going to get both hit by that a thermal detonator. I think there might be a boost here in the future of green. Yep, looks like there's the boost. Rose does not want to get hit by that either. But I don't think she even has a boost or barrel or something like that. Does she have a barrel? She does, but it's a red barrel, and she's gonna have. Ooh, no rose. That is a one hard right turn from Zam into a bump. We got a three-ton roll off the rock. 
but not template is not on the rock. I just hope that oh, there is a hit on red from the one thermal dead. And there is a strain. Oh, I think that is for no can't be. Yeah, that's for yellow. And next double dead goes off. Oh, running blank. And running hit. So yellow takes the shield as well. Another thermal dead going off. Onto red only this time. Train. And a, another strain on red and blue needs to roll as well. That is a strain on blue. Rose getting shot at there. From Django. Range 3. Hit focus blank. He rerolls with Lone Wolf. And then spends a force. The rerolls Lone Wolf spends a force. That is Rose off the field, guys. Took a hit, and that's Rose off the field. The Rose is dead. Range one into green from Zam. Hit focus focus blank. And it is a evade and a focus. So nothing on green. Arc for green, nothing. Blue bumped, nothing's gonna happen there. Red can't shoot anything. Yellow is probably the one that's got the only shot. Uh, there is a range two shot at Zam from yellow. Who gets a hit and two focuses? He's spinning that focus, obviously. Okay, so why did that turn to a blank again? Oh, it's a uh, Dooku. So that was a... Oops, sorry. That was a hit hit and a blank. And two focuses by Zam. That puts Zam on two less shields. Back to Dals. No more shots left. It's a beautiful thing about the orcs at the back of these slaves. They don't really have to turn around. But... They want full guns on. They will... No, they don't really need to turn around. They can just pot shot the whole time out of the rear guns. Still have three dice. And they should be fine.
So thank you for everyone joining the stream here. Got 32, 31 minutes left on this game. And uh, let's see if I can find for you guys some results in the other game. Thanks for the subs, guys. Really appreciate it. Thumbs up. Where is... See if I can find some details on other game happening. Is that on YouTube or is that on Twitch? I think they might be streaming on Twitch, guys. Yes. Game is live on Twitch. Other game between Hungary and Spain. From what I can see currently at the moment, I think uh, we have Hungary leading 100 points to 42 in the other game. Cool. So, Right, we had a 4k there from this one up to get three. No, he did a quite on turn. Okay, no, it was 4k turn. Sorry, 4k turn blue rookie number four. He turned right and did a barrel up. Yellow is flying out the bank to left. See Zam dropped in the thermal dead. Kind of missed it. And boosting out there with yellow. Red does it too hard left. Doesn't get rid of that strains though, but we don't have to worry about strain. When it comes to action economy or actions in general because strain doesn't prevent us from doing actions is a one hard a uh, one bank move from the zam and he flew into blue so the block worked there from blue x-wing Django is moved three straight and still needs to take a action. So in arc range two from Django is blue X-wing and because we've got two strains he doesn't roll any dice so this is a X-Wing with no dice. No. Two strains. Well, it's just a one effect of having a strain. It crit blank. Into an evade. So he takes only one more shield on blue. Almost half points on blue. Spain went up to 30 points because of Rose's death. So now currently Spain leading 30 points to zero over Hungary. 
I forgot to let that bomb go off. So there is another strain going on to yellow X-Wing. So now I need to check for Zam for a shot. So is that not Zam shooting into yellow X-Wing? Looks like it. It's a reroll. It goes dog lock. So it is a crit hit and a blank. Yellow X-Wing rolls a focus and two evades. Oops. Focus and two blanks. Therefore taking one more shield. Wait, did he move? He lose, lost two shields. How did he lose two shields? Oh, hang on. I missed the bomb. And then the crit that jumps on him is structural damage. Sorry guys, I missed that there. Two dice from blue on Django. Hit and a hit and a blank. Evade and a blank from Django. Nothing happens. Range 2 on Zam from Green X-Wing. 3 dice. Hit hit and focus. Nothing can be spent from Green. Let's check. Oh, into Zam. Zam spends a force. He still has a force left. There's hit and blank. So only one more hit from Green onto Zam. Zam is now officially half points, guys. Yeah, officially half points. Zam reveals a card. He spends two dice to shoot back at green. Uh, two charges to spin back at green. Shoots, and it's all three focuses. Testing the guns, as we might say. I got that to go to mark. I just made sure. That my guns are still operating in some capacity. Right guys, so the points has changed. We got Spain now currently on 51 points. Due to the extra half points he got on the X-Wing. And we've got half points on Zam. So Hungary is now on 46 points. So Spain still leading with 5 points. 51 to 46. Still 22 minutes to go, so there is still a lot that can happen. I guess we have another like six rounds, give or take, possibly. Well, it's a little bit of a slower game than I'm used to. These guys obviously need to concentrate. Make sure they don't mess up what they need to do. Maneuvers are set on Spain's side. So they are ready to go. Ooh. Yeah. Just need the two dials still from Hungary. And making sure the maneuver he's choosing is correct. Making sure the tokens are correct. He would have regen the force there on Zam, I think. I don't have a token indicator for Zam because the force doesn't 
show up either even if they put the, the guys like Dooku or so on them. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, just to mention that uh, Hungary is, uh, I think, 4-1 ahead on this, in this series, uh, in this round over Spain, if not mistaken. Go on, just sit still. Right, that is a ready Hungary. And obviously a ready Spain as well. Woohoo! Here is Ibam from Zam, the last one. The last the thermal detonator. As the Aninator. <laughs> One hard, one hard, one bank, one bank. You're right from blue. Taking a focus, looking for a potential bump. Green does a three straight forward. Cannot use that BVA charge because he is a stress die. He's going to attempt to target lock. He's going to attempt to target lock. He doesn't care about that thermal detonator that's lying right behind him. Because he is in a good track to be able to get. Django to bump. And yeah, I think there's a potential boost in the future. Boosty Banky in. Says got left boost. I was wondering if he really should do the uh, the three talent, but doesn't look that bad. A bit further away now, so the guys won't be able to shoot him directly. Django doing a one hard right. He stays there. Yellow won't be able to shoot him very hard, but he'll still have red and green to deal with. Bond barrel roll as far as I know, doesn't have a barrel option. No, only a boost. Taking a focus, he's choosing violence. And here comes Django with a three bank left. Was it three bank? No. Turned. Yeah, that's right, three bank left. Taking a focus, also choosing violence. Bone goes off. Roll for damage. One a damage on a green. Right, range of one into a green X Wing. Hit two focuses and a blank. Spins a focus into three hits. Two evade, Natty's out. And one shield down on green. Zam shooting at green again. They've got beef. 
They would not want green to shoot with that target lock. Crit, two focus and a blank. Spins his focus. Crit hit it. Oh, and there is a focus and a blank on green. The green takes one shield and he takes a hit and he takes a crit. Wounded pilot. Not the worst. Just a stress token. It's not damage though. Now they've got time to shoot back. Oh, yellow is just out of arc. Sorry, range. In arc, out of range. Zam, zam, zam. Alright guys, long day. Okay, three shots on two. Who are you shooting at, friend? Probably Zam. So that is a hit focus and a blank. Zam does not have anything to say about that. Oh no, you spent the force. Sorry, you spent the force. Oh bad. So he's revealing his Zam card, and Zam is shooting back at red. No, he's taking a target lock. He said, I shoot, thank you. It looks like it might be a range one shot onto Zam from green. Was range one onto Django? No, he's got a tog lock, so it's range one onto Django, I think. Yes. Range one onto Django from green. So it's a crit. And the end result is a focus and two blanks. Django rolls a evade and a focus. What that was pointed at Tensela Purpleton. Tensela Pupatin. Hey. Let me check the board state, guys, quickly. Let's check a bit right here. Four shields down on Zam plus damage. That's right. Two shields down on Django. Rose is dead. Blue Squadron has got four hull left. Green has got. Green's got two hull left with a wounded pilot. Structural damage on yellow with three hull left. And then a one shield down red squadron X Wing. Well. Zam doesn't have any thermal that's left anymore. So it seems that Django might still get rid of the the two that he has. Will actually work in his favor, I think, if he drops both. Because he could think she can take green out if green rolls the dice that he wants. If green roll green does go into both the units. Most viable option for green now is just to do a two bank forward.
I will see blue doing a poker. Or maybe just a 3 talent roll. I would say 3 talent roll, right? Yellow is going to do a 3 straight. Or a 2 straight. Uh, green has to do a 2 straight or a 2 bank. And red is going to possibly just do a 1 heart. No, 1 heart. Do you have a 1 heart? Uh, maybe a 2 heart lift? See if we get into Zango. Not Zango. Uh, Zam. And there is the last two bombs from Django being deported out of the cargo hold at range 1 and range 2. Too hard to write. Interesting. Right, oh. Dog lock on Zam from Blue. He decides to stay there and risk the bombs. One bank right from Green. Sitting nice and slug there behind, uh, behind Zam. Rolls for. What did he roll for? Green, green, green. Oh yeah, wounded pilot. He doesn't take the stress. He didn't roll anything. No strain for going over that rock. Does remove one though because of the green. Hmm. Django going A2 straight. Damn, just did too hard out there. Alright, bomb goes off. Blue rolls. Nothing. Second one takes a hit. The blue is down at the hole. Wait, hang on. That's a strain on green. I need to roll for blue. Okay, never mind. Looks like he's roll for blue first. Yeah. Uh, yes, blue was first roll. Yeah. Okay, so range one out to rear. It's a hit focus and two blanks. It's Lone Wolf into a hit. Spending the force. Turns into three hits. One evade from green. Green takes three hits. That is enough to kill him. Green only needs two hits. Green is down. 
Spain taking a little bit more points here. With Rose down and Green down. Half points on blue, I think. Yeah, half points on blue. And half points on yellow. Under is leading so far this game. So, Zam three dice. Oh, look at those dice fall onto each other. So he's spending his fours. Change, crit, hit, hit. Let's just take a shot that I actually missed that. No, why don't green? On blue. Okay, so blue's also down. Three hits on blue. Oh, and Spain racks up a bit more points here. Range three on Django from red. Three dice. And Django's also got three dice. Crit, crit, and a blank. Let's see if Django can evade that. Django, two evades, and a blank. Yellow is in arc as well. It's... Ooh, crit, hit, hit, natties. And it takes evade and two blanks. So that's the last two shields of Django. Django needs one more damage to be half points. But it looks like the score is a bit further apart now. 135 for Spain, 46 for Hungary, and three minutes left to play. Ord State. Yellow Rookie has got three shields left. Blue Rookie has got lost one shield. Ah, oh, sorry, Blue Rookie. Red X-Wing. Django needs one more for half points, only on a hull left, and Zam has got five hull left. His x is finding it difficult to hit through on these on these slaves. These slaves packing a bit of a punch here with the thermal deaths and uh, the dice rolls. So, uh, yeah, guys. This is happening. What state is right? Next, did you just put the wrong, uh, the wrong damage caused the wrong ship. But he knew which one it was. So welcome once again to everyone who watch, watched the stream and is watching the stream and has joined. Thank you for the support. I appreciate it. And always good to hit that subscribe button. Okay, so Red is spending a, a BB-8 charge to barrel out. And with that doing a 3 straight. He just clipped that guy's cloud though. Guy's cloud, is he going to get a strain or a hit? Oh, it's a strain. I can't get a, a hit on a gas start if I'm mistaken. Right, a blue maneuver was revealed. Two bank. He's going for the block on Django. That red can get a bit more hits onto Django, potentially. So, although he is unmodified. 
One straight from Zam. Probably just needs to focus. 44 seconds left. And there is the bump on Django. So, will he be able to rack in a few more points? It's not going to be enough though if he gets half. Let's see what happens. Zam shooting on red. Red's got a strain. So red's only rolling one dice. Hit crit focus. I think he spins a target lock first. Rerolls into a hit. And uses the focus. Oops. Three hits. And that is two shields and a hit down on rookie. A red X-Wing. That is the time, guys. That is the time. But they still have to finish their round of firing. Red X-Wing is now officially half points. That is now Red X-Wing firing into Django. Oops. And... Yeah, the uh, what is not active. That is two hits. Django takes two more hits. Ben's Lone Wolf. Is it going to be enough? Nope. It doesn't have focus either. Ben's one force to change it. That's the end result. He takes a hit. Half points. On Django. And that if not mistaken guys that is the game there's no more shots that can be fired there's no more runs that can be done both these players played very well flying very good getting those arcs on i don't think there was any round of firing that there was not an arc on someone very good game guys very very good game so uh Let's go join the guys quickly in the channel and uh, see what they have to say. So give me one second, let me just move over there quickly. Get an after action report from the players themselves. Yeah. Hold on, I'll be there in a second. It's always, better, it's, it's yeah. always better to make a, a box that yeah. um, block uh, to the fire space yes. because yes. they have. Uh, if you block, then you, you lose a you lose a, a shoot. Yes, uh, yes. Sometimes, although you you have a, a great power in because uh, you have uh, four three four ships with uh, three dice attack. So yeah, uh, but. Was, 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 anyway, uh, it, was, it, it was a good game. Yeah, yeah, it was. It was. And uh, again, congratulations for the run. Thank you and congratulations for this win. So, Arnie is here. I think he is. He, he yes, I am. Sorry, I just forgot to put my <laughs> mic back on again. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, guys, you're still live on stream. How was it? How was the game? Good? Uh, yes, it, yeah. it, it, it I, really was. I told yeah. uh, I told Ander that uh, that this was, for me this was a very useful game because I never never played uh, against two fire sprays. Yeah. At first, I yeah. uh, I was thinking about to blocking them, but now I know that I don't have to try blocking them. I have to shoot them. Correct. Yeah. No. 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 You you just need to put as much as possible damage into these fire sprays. And yes. uh, that's that's the main point, yeah, definitely, yeah. definitely. So yeah, guys, uh, congratulations on the windy uh, under. Well done. Thank you. Go cool, go cool, cool. And uh, yeah, guys, um, let me quickly do a sign off, and then we can chat afterwards as well. So thank you much for the game, the opportunity to stream the game for you guys. So pretty cool. Uh, like thank you, thank you for your effort. Not a problem. I hope everyone enjoyed it. So, uh, yeah, let me do the sign-off quickly. Uh, thanks, everyone, for watching. Uh, like and subscribe if you guys haven't yet. 
um, uh, comment below if you guys want to and uh, yes let's take it from there so thanks once again under and rafi for the game well done thank you and congratulate you under thank you and congratulate you hungary for the for the round for winning thank the you. round thank you cool thank you. cool cool and congratulations to both of you guys very good very good sport so uh, that is me signing off and um, we'll see you guys soon there is a few games happening as well i think but later on tonight still so watch out for the streams and games happening yeah. tomorrow and sunday so and also for the next week <laughs> yes and next week around seven so yeah, uh watch yeah. out for that as well guys we'll stream that as well okay so okay. i'm gonna sign Thank off you. quickly and um let me just sign off quickly and see you guys later cheers thank you bye bye thank you bye, bye. good night have a, um, good luck for the next good. one